Mr. President, on behalf of the entire Biden family and the American people, happy 100th birthday. Mr. President, you've always been a moral force for our nation and the world. I recognize that as a young senator. That's why I supported you so early. You're a voice of courage, conviction, compassion. Most of all, beloved friend of Jill, me, and our family. We know this is the first birthday without Rosalind. It's bittersweet, but we also know she's always with you. She's in your heart. She never go away. She may be gone, but she's always going to be with you. She's always there, and I know you know that. Your hopeful vision of our country, your commitment to a better world, and your unwavering belief in the power of human goodness continues to be a guiding light for all of us. You know, you're one of the most influential statesmen in our history. Even after you left office, the moral clarity you showed throughout your career showed through again in your commitment through the Carter Center and the Habitat for Humanity, resolving conflicts, advancing democracy, preventing disease, and so much more. It's transforming the lives of people not only at home but around the world. Put simply, Mr. President, I admire you so darn much. Jill and I send to you and your incredible family our love. May God continue to bless you, Mr. President. You've been a good friend.